A rise in hospitalizations for COVID-19 cases now has health experts in the Roanoke Allegheny Health Districts calling for more vigilance in order to curb the spread. 10 News reporter Annie Schroeder is live tonight. She's outside Carillion Roanoke Memorial Hospital with the very latest on this look at the new numbers. Annie. John, that's right. Health leaders in our area say they are seeing the most COVID related hospitalizations since March. And while capacity is not yet an issue, they say they are frustrated because these cases can be prevented. Health officials with the Roanoke City and Allegheny Health Districts are asking the community to do their part in preventing the spread of COVID-19 and putting a potential burden on local hospitals. We have far too many people hospitalized with this disease and so it's just so important that we do whatever we can to protect ourselves and protect each other. This week, the Virginia Department of Health is reporting an increase of 11 hospitalizations related to COVID, bringing the total to 50 in the Roanoke Allegheny region. Molly O'Dell with the Department of Health says certain races are being disproportionately impacted in admissions to the hospitals. I can tell you that 23% of all of our admissions have been African Americans and 15% of our hospitalizations overall have been Hispanic. So for hospitalizations, there is a disparity. Health leaders with Carillion Memorial Hospital, Lewis Gale Medical Center, and the Salem VA Medical Center sent out a joint statement asking the community to prevent the transmission of the virus. Now is not the time to let our guard down. We must remain vigilant. If we don't, the virus would take advantage of our weariness. Health department leaders warn that as flu season quickly approaches, it is up to everyone to seriously follow the guidelines to prevent a further spike in hospitalizations, outbreaks, and COVID-19 cases. But our numbers are, are telling us that this is an ongoing fight against COVID and we need to stay on, on top of it by, by doing everything that we can. Now, the hospital says it is taking extra precautions just in case capacity does become an issue. The Department of Health says it also is considering new practices in uh, hopes of encouraging the community to take these guidelines more seriously. Live in Roanoke tonight, Annie Schroeder, 10 News, working for you.